Well, gardeners can get a jump start on spring this weekend. The annual Yard, Garden, and Patio Show actually starts today, and Drew Carney is out and about at the convention center to show us what they have to offer this year. Drew, good morning. Good morning, Russ and Brenda. This is an annual Brenda Braxton favorite, I know. It's the Yard, Garden, and Patio Show happening here. Here is the Oregon Convention Center. When? Today, tomorrow, and Sunday. Three days. Again, I can't stress it enough. Oregon Convention Center. Annual Yard, Garden, and Patio Show. There's lots to talk about in regards to this show. Uh, we're going to try to cover a lot of ground in the next hour and a half. We'll start with the Showcase Gardens. There are seven this year. Uh, they call them the Seven Gardens of the World. Each garden represents a different international culture. Dennis's Seven Days Landscaping went after the Chinese Garden idea. Drew Snodgrass, another Drew, in yeah. the segment. Let's talk about your garden. I'm going to clear my throat for a minute because I'm ill. Oh. <clears throat> it's a professional TV move. Don't try that one, Drew, here. Uh, I'm really uh, drawn to your lake effect here. This lake looks like it goes forever, and you tell me it's not deep at all, so how do you create that deep effect? Well, that's a reflecting pond, and by dyeing the water, you get a depth creator. And it's only six inches deep. Six inches? Yes. And actually, for kids, if you want a pond while the kids are young, it's a pretty neat way to do it, because you can dig the pond deep, fill it up, have it be four or six inches deep, either see the rock or blacken it so it looks like it's really deep. And we're standing on what appear to be floating rocks, but these are not floating rocks, so how do you create this effect? These are basically blocks with this rock on top. They're not glued, it's strong enough that it moves zero. Um, so, very calming effect. Uh, you get the water between. And it serves another function where the stream behind us agitates the water. These steps actually slow the water so you get the mirror pond on the opposite effect. And like, side. two word answer, plant next door, what is it? Edwardia, and that is a fragrant, very early spring bloomer. Awesome plant for really a pot or entry or feature in your landscape. Good way to start the program this morning, Drew. Drew Snodgrass, Dennis's 70s Landscaping. They created this showcase garden. There are six others to check out, and we've got a lot more to check out regarding the yard, garden, and patio show.